So let's look at this organic technology. What is it? What does it do? What are the different forms that it comes in? So just hold on a second here. Now the first one are replicators. Replicators are devices that can consciously turn any form of energy into any physical form that we can use. And that in includes food, clothing, furniture, and anything else that you could possibly need, such as housing, etc. Now let's go to food. Let's say you order some kind of Thai food, because I happen to like Thai food, so I use this. What happens is you can tell the computer, because the replicator is basically a high artificial intelligence device, it's, but it's an organic device. It resembles us. We can put it in any form that we wish, and it will create. In this case, it's creating Thai food. But as I said, it can create any kind of clothing, handbags, accessories, dresses, whatever. It also can create furniture, a table, chairs, whatever. In this case, it just says, how spicy do you want your Thai noodles? And it just says, I would say, Thai extra spicy hot for me, please. So that's the device. Now, that's just one form. These are a class of them just called replicators. They come in all sizes and shapes. Just remember that. Don't look at the shape of this particular device as being a mirror all for everything. It's just an example. Another device, communicators. Communicators are devices which use the impulses in our brain. Our brain, when it comes to languaging, produces basic electrical signals which come down to looking through our visionary system as various forms of shapes and sizes. You put them together, they create vowels and consonants which make up words, which make up sentences, which make up basic concepts, what we want to talk about. So what this translator does, it goes into everybody's brain because Fully conscious beings, limited conscious beings, they have the same basic prototype of shapes and sizes in their brain when these impulses for language come forth. So what happens is the flat metallic button mysteriously will stick to your shirt due to a special rubbery substance that looks like a, a belly button. And you can see that on, on the back there. Whenever you hear someone speak, your mind will easily translate it into your native tongue because it hears the shapes and sizes. So what the translator does is it makes sure that these shapes are communicated to you at the lowest common de denominator, which are these shapes. So when you hear somebody talk, it doesn't come into your mind as, let's say, a person speaking Mandarin talking to somebody that's, that's talking German. It comes into the German as German to the Mandarin per speaking person as Mandarin. And the nice thing is because it uses the codes of everyone's brain, it comes in the way everybody understands, in other words, how you speak. So it's completely understood. The uh, colloquial expressions, the words you most like to use come in. So you think this other person really speaks like you, but he's not or she is not. It just allows you to communicate instantaneously with one another. So communicators are a second device. Healing. By using the love and balance of a healer, using special devices, you can then use that to heal anything. And I know that because when I was a kid, my dad was a professional boxer and trainer, and he had a nasty temper. And whenever he would hit me too hard, they would take me up and put me on this special little table which had these devices I'm talking about, and they would all put their hands up, use their vast amounts of fully conscious energy. They would bring my soul energy in by first bringing in my auric field, my essence, and then they would take that essence, spread it across the body, and basically transform the body from its necrosis aspect of being dead to a living aspect. And then you would see yourself come alive and I've seen that many times where I wake up and the first thing you do is you feel this incredible loving energy around you and you don't ask questions about it you just enjoy it it's uh, it's like a little treat 